my name is Andy Golub. I'm a body paint artist, uh, although I am I paint other things other than bodies. And uh, I'm also I run a nonprofit organization called Human Connection Arts, and we produce uh, an event called Body Painting Day. And uh, coming up this Sunday, July 23rd, we're having our 10-year anniversary of New York City Body Painting Day, and we're going to have. 40 artists painting 50 fully nude models of all shapes and sizes for four hours in full public view. Oh wow! Still on the coming. How are you? I'm sort of confused in a way as I'm painting it, but I'm also kind of like feeling like there's like this, you know, like this pattern that's emerging. So I, I feel like I'm getting that from the person. In 2011, we, me and two models got arrested, spent 24 hours in jail, um, but it was legal and so charges were dropped. And then I started just painting with other artists because people were calling me up and they're like, oh, this is really cool. I'd love to paint with you. And I was like, sure. And then there were so many that I was like, let's just make a day and we'll all paint together. You'll find there's a lot of people that have been really impacted positively, uh, mostly models, but also artists and feeling they've, they've come out of their skin. And it's just been like a really positive experience of, of really celebrating freedom and celebrating people just not being afraid of you know, showing the world like this is who I am and not really feeling shame, you know. To well, just because you do new things doesn't mean you can't keep doing body painting day, which is funny. But I think that it's not true. I think that because it's not a matter of what you do, it's like, it's your headspace. And it's sort of like, it's time to move on, which means sometimes it's good to clear the plate, stop doing one thing and say, what do I really am my feeling? I, I believe you, but you know, you're never too old to do this kind of stuff. Well, maybe you're right, you're right. You're probably right. And she's got a great body.